Okay, so we're going to talk about when is the best time to meditate. And, you know, this is really going to come down a lot to, to you, to, to, to the individual and their temperaments and, and, uh, and circumstances and so on. Um, but there are guidelines we can follow. And uh, as I say, when you get more experience um, with meditation, uh, like, like me, you will get to a place where you can pretty much meditate um, no matter what you're doing. Like I could just like do a quick meditation now, like just one breath can, can completely reboot me because I know how to access the sort of, uh, you know, the, 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 the deeper essence of meditation so that but so we're going to talk about when's the best time to do meditation anyway so uh we're going to start with uh morning and and, and um you know like as i say i come from a a, a yoga bra uh, background a kundalini uh yoga background and uh you know in in, in that w we 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 practice a very early morning um meditation and yoga practice and um, we actually do this in the ambrosial hours so it's called the ambrosial hours and it's it, it's a very special time before the dawn so it's kind of like before the you know the sun rises and brings a uh, new life to the day a new light to illuminate the day there's a special kind of quiet time a time of like great peace and quiet and and potency and that's um, said to be the best time to to really get quiet, to get peaceful, to get centered, and to practice meditation and and yoga. And so, um, but I'm not saying you need to get up that early, like at half past three or whatever. What I'm saying is, like, if you do allocate some time, and if you're an early bird or you're a morning person, then this is this is going to be really really good really really good for you if you're not like it might be a bit more difficult but you might just want to try it out anyway like set your alarm a bit earlier than normal you know like 5 10 20 minutes half an hour earlier however much time you think you can spend the better like the more we can give our time um to meditation the better our life is going to pan out like the dalai lama gets up at 2 a.m and meditates for five hours but the good news is by seven he's done <laughs> yeah I, yeah i was actually lucky enough to see the dalai lama last week at the uh the glastonbury festival we uh i've still got the um the band actually like yeah i was uh clearing clearing the path uh for him to to drive past that so my morning my, my early morning meditation was actually clearing the litter from the for the festival and then we were fortunate enough for him to to drive past so it's like clearing clearing the sacred way so that so yeah anyway so, it, so I, I learned that he actually gets up at uh, at 2 a.m and meditates for five hours so so if i'm asking you to get up uh, 10 minutes early just remember that remember the dalai lama actually gets up at two in the morning oh my god i can't even imagine getting up <laughs> i get up, i think a half past three or, or or four or five is early enough but so so but what i'm saying is if you can get up early that is what happens is, and you meditate it's going to change your whole day because that's the first thing you do and the first thing that you do just sets a precedent for the rest of the day so if you just get up and you you know you sort of rushing around you know your alarm goes off and you, you know you you sleep in and you, you know rushing to brush your teeth and rushing your breakfast and you're rushing to work the whole day you're rushing yeah and and then even though you might settle in, eventually you never really relax. But if you get up and you set your alarm early and you just like meditate for like five, ten minutes and then you have your breakfast and you've given yourself enough time, you like taking everything slowly, you know, and it's like you feel good, you notice the weather, you don't, you know, however the weather is, you feel all right, you notice the good things, you notice the birds, you excuse me, you notice the birds singing, you just notice... You know, you take your, your perspective to shifts, you know, and then so it sets a precedent. You, you sort of say good morning to people. You, you you start. Have you ever noticed that if you start the day badly, it tends to go badly. If you start the day well, then it goes well. Well, then start every day well. And 
meditation will give you the ability to do that. So I do definitely recommend um, trying out morning meditation. If you're a morning person, that's great. You're already on your way. If you're not, well, just just try it anyway. But you know, it's it's uh, is there's no right or wrong time to meditate. As there's no right or wrong way to meditate. But yeah, as I say, this is um, this is one way. This is one time of doing it, and we'll explore some other great great times to meditate as well in the next video.